United States and its Department of Homeland Security need more brain power in the fight against cyber terrorism. And today, the Homeland Security Secretary came to Silicon Valley and San Jose State University to get that help. Jenna Napolitano says cybersecurity is being threatened every day, and she wants students to consider joining the front line of defense. KTV's Robert Honda live now at San Jose State University to tell us about her pitch. Robert? Well, the secretary came here to the San Jose campus to talk about cybersecurity, but it became obvious this was also a trip to recruit students into the battle against cyber attacks. The Secretary of Homeland Security, Janet Napolitano, came to San Jose State University today for a town hall meeting on how to make the ever-growing cyber domain secure. She acknowledged the Department of Homeland Security has its hands full with cyber attacks here and around the world. There really is, at this point in time, no international environment in which to deal with those activities. There's no, there's no Geneva Convention on cyber. There's no UN a convention on, on cyber. The secretary made it obvious while a crowd of mostly engineering students came to see her, she also came to see the students to recruit them into the war on cyber terrorism. We need you, we want you, uh, and we uh, believe that this is a great, a great thing you can contribute uh, to your country. The recruiting pitch surprised some students, especially those who only thought of their skills in terms of Facebook or Google. A few told us Napolitano hit a patriotic chord. I think the government's role is to protect us, and I think it's our role to tell the government how we need to be protected. Being a hobbyist is different from actually making that your job. Um, and so I'd like to look into it and be able to, to see how I can apply it in the future. Paul Zoda, chief technology officer for high-tech security firm CyberFalcon, believes many engineering students will respond to the challenge of trying to outthink hackers and terrorists. Is it possible to remotely perform 9-11 behind a computer by hacking into a plane? San Jose State and the Department of Homeland Security will use those kinds of scenarios for a cyber camp here in August. Live in San Jose, Robert Honda, KTVU, Channel 2 News. Oh.